My name is Matt Brust, and I'm from the Washington Hospitality Association. I wanted to take a second today to talk to you about the Washington Hospitality Grant Program, which is a grant that's being administered by Forward and BDS Urban Planning and Design on behalf of the Washington State Department of Commerce. One of the association's goals is to serve as the primary source of information for the hospitality industry. We wanted to share about this opportunity and how we found best to navigate the platform. This is recorded as of March 15th. If you do not already have a forward account, you will need to make one to apply for the grant. You can click the create a business account button to begin creating your first account. After you follow the steps there, you will receive an email where you can set your password. Once you have done that, you can then log into your account. When you're logging into your account, make sure you log into a business account, not an individual account. So I'm going to log into this business account. After you log in, the first thing I want to draw your attention to is at the top right where it says WHA test two. Here's where I can see other businesses that I've assigned to my forward profile. I can swap between them and my individual profile. You always want to be on a business profile if you're applying for the Washington Hospitality Grant. The next thing I want to draw your attention to is the three tabs over here about programs in my application. The first thing we want to go to is the about section. There's some information in here that you need to fill out for purposes of the grant application, but there's a lot of fields that are not required. So the first things I want to draw your attention to are an overview. An overview, you need to make sure that you have a business and organization name filled out, DBA name filled out if that's applicable to you, and employee identification number. You do not need to fill out DUNS, SAMS, established year, or business and organization description. After you've finished providing your address and contact information, the next section is categories. You will need to do organization type and tax classification type. Once you've completed those two things, the next section is people. People is only applicable if you share ownership with your business or if you have staff that will be helping you with the application process. Let's go to programs and let's try applying for the grant. After you click apply, you'll see that the information that you had in the about section has been filled and brought over into the top parts of your application. If you see anything that appears wrong or anything you want to correct, you can always click the edit section that is below each section. So edit overview, edit categories, edit contact info, and edit people. The next section that we should touch on is documents. For this grant, there are a number of document types that you may need to upload in order to apply for the grant. When you click upload a document, the type that you want to select is Washington Hospitality Grant. The subtype depends on what type of document you're uploading. I'm going to click here and leave it up so you can see the options. The only time you need to provide lodging expenses is if we're talking about eviction moratorium losses. If your business was open for all of 2019, you should upload a 2019 annual tax return and a 2020 annual tax return for comparison. If your business was open for part of 2019, you should open a 2019 quarterly tax return with a like quarter for 2020. So Q2 of 2019 compared to Q2 of 2020. If your business was open, only in 2020, you will need to upload Q1 of 2020 and compare it to another quarter in 2020. If you run into issues with this grant, you can contact your territory manager. If you want help from the people who are administering this grant, you can go to wahospitalitygrants.com slash contact. Or you can call the phone number 866-220-7474 and ask for assistance or email whyhospitality at forwardplatform.zendesk.com. These are the people that are administering the grant and they're the best ones able to answer technical questions. Territory managers and myself will do the best of our abilities to answer your questions. Thank you for being a member of the Washington Hospitality Association.